Hi everyone, I hope you're doing well and welcome to my channel. I'll just say this, The Nightmare Before Christmas Tarot Deck is probably the biggest release for this spooky season. Keep watching as I review the official Nightmare Before Christmas Tarot Deck. Happy spooky Halloween season everyone. This is my review of the Nightmare Before Christmas Tarot Deck. Before we get into the review, I am a huge fan of the Nightmare Before Christmas movie. It is one of my most favorite movies of all time. I destroyed the, my VHS copy because I watched it so many times. Um, this is going to be a non-biased review. I am going to be very honest about this deck. I will say flat out this that this is a missed opportunity deck. It is a gorgeous deck, but it is a deck that I feel is very incomplete. So let's go ahead and get started. So it's gonna come in this nice box and it's a pull open and it has this gorgeous inside. And the guidebook is pretty decent. It is in color. I feel that this guidebook is very beginner friendly. It is um, written by, I'm not even gonna try to pronounce that. She had written Tarot for Self Care, which is a really gorgeous book. And when I was reading the guidebook for The Nightmare Before Christmas, I definitely got those vibes from her. Her writing is something you can't um, miss. Um, for, for the guidebook, the meanings are very generic and especially for the minors. But when you get into the majors, um, it does have like, she talks about the character in the cards and, um, but it's still like a very generic meaning written down. Um, so when we get into the cards, um, the majors, I absolutely love every single major card. Um, the card stock is going to be thin. It's matte, um, but I sh I don't riffle shuffle, so I overhand shuffle, so they're gonna last me. The, the card back is gorgeous. It reminds me of wallpaper. So for the majors, they are fully illustrated. They are cards that pop with color, character, and even some like all of these minor characters that had a brief cameo in the movie, they are here. And I love the mayor as the Hierophant. It is just gorgeous major arcana cards. So I feel like this deck is incomplete. Um, you have like these gorgeous aces and when you get into the cards, they remind me of pip decks. And you know, for someone who's 
very into the image itself, not necessarily the, the numerology, they're going to have a difficult time. When we get into the court cards, I actually don't mind these. I just feel like this deck doesn't know what it wants to be. Was it be a fully pip deck or a fully illustrated deck? It's just a deck that is a missed opportunity. I feel like this is not the full Nightmare Before Christmas tarot deck. Um, I do really actually enjoy the deck. It is a gorgeous deck. All of the majors are gorgeous and the card stock is just gorgeous to, just to shuffle with. It's just a shame that this deck isn't what I imagined this deck should be. If you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. In the comments below, let me know if you have this deck and what are your thoughts on it. Again, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.